later on one has to think already about how does he arrange himself how does he arrange within himself a place where he will build an image of a stranger, another person, because otherwise he will not be able to truly connect with him. Rather, they just become foreign bodies in which, so that between there were all kinds of uh, laws of uh, behavior, rules of uh, conduct, so that they don't harm each other. But if a person really wants to connect to another, then he already has a problem. He needs to examine and measure and build and establish within himself the image of the other. And he realizes that only with that image will he be able to connect. He never has a possibility to do it with the other. We can never come out of ourselves and feel the other. Rather, what we can feel is the image of the other that we build within ourselves. How do we build it? By, first of all, being willing to restrict ourselves. And when we want to restrict ourselves, when we're willing to do it, when we realize how important it is, since by this we actually come out to the other upper world, and by this we become similar to the Creator, and we begin to construct within us, within our will to receive, strange images of those who are strangers for us to begin with as we were born, images of strangers of foreign people, where I am willing to project, copy my impression of them into me, within me, and that way I begin to integrate with my ten, that is, I can understand and feel what does it mean to be a Parsuf. And that's on the one hand. On the other hand, I also want to be included in them so that they will understand and feel who I am. 